Hi, I'm John Byrne with Poets of Quants. Welcome to another edition of our one-on-one -on -one video series with leading business school officials. Today we have two officials from the Gabelli School of Business at Fordham University. We have Donna Rapacholi, who is the Dean of the Gabelli School. We have Dawn Lerman, who is the Associate Dean of Graduate Programs. Welcome. Thank you. We're happy to be here. So what differentiates Gabelli from other business schools? I'll mention two things. The first is our New York City location and the second is our Jesuit ethos. Being in New York, we have access to wonderful guest speakers, practicing professionals serve as adjuncts, our students get special site visits. In fact, this week our students are ringing the closing bell. They visit Tiffany's, Bank America. We also have the ability to be in touch with our alumni because Fordham has over 33,000 alumni from the business school and many of them are located in New York. So our students have a really easy time reaching out to do an informational interview or just grab a coffee. So Dawn, to what extent do you use New York as a sort of living, learning laboratory? We do extensively and our MBAs experience that throughout their entire program. We take them throughout the city to learn about New York City as, as a business capital mm -hmm. uh, and the relationship between business and the city. New York as a finance capital, New York as a media capital, a fashion capital, uh, an entertainment capital, an advertising capital, and so on. And they do this actually by meeting with C-suite executives. Being a Jesuit business school really drives home that we're a values-based business school. For us, profits and purpose align. The other thing that's really important about a Jesuit education is that it's very applied. Mm -hmm. So it's important to understand theory, but the best way to learn is to take that theory and apply it to real world settings. So you'll see that our curriculum is really infused from day one all the way through graduation with opportunities for the students to apply their skills to the real world setting. We developed an entire suite of co-curricular activities that align and enhance uh, what's happening in the classroom and we put these throughout the program at the right time based on what the students are, are learning in their coursework. So for example, our MBAs this past August learned about uh, cross-cultural management challenges uh, by watching them being enacted by a group of actors. We also have our students learning from jazz musicians how to think on their feet. How to improvise. How to improvise, that's right. Later in the year, our students spend a full day at Randall's Island at the training facility that New York City firefighters go to to train to be a firefighter. And they learn about teamwork, collaboration, uh, on-the-spot decision-making, and uh, those are just some of the examples. In addition to the MBA program, you obviously have a portfolio of other um, graduate programs. Give me a sense of the range of those specialized master's programs and, and which one's the most popular? So we have a large suite, as you mentioned, of MS programs and they range from analytics and finance and also to general management. So the most popular is Master of Science in Global Finance and this attracts uh, almost 200 students every year. It involves both classroom learning and it offers the opportunity for internships. And there are a number of practicing professionals that teach in the program. Your advice to an applicant would be what? To visit Fordham, to visit us. Our culture is different. It's a very collaborative environment. It's about me and you rather than me or you. And we think that if you visit, you'll really get a great sense of what it's like to be an MBA or an MS student. So. My best advice is visit. Now some people who haven't been to New York are afraid of it because it's such a big city and it's such a competitive city. What do you say to them? The city is a grid. It's easy to get used to. Subway system works really well and we're very friendly people. I've lived in New York my whole life and we are a very friendly group and we look for people to come to us. And if you can make it here, you, you can, can make, make it, it anywhere. anywhere. Donna Dawn, thank you very much. This is John Byrne with Poets and Quants. Thanks for watching.